we'll guide you through how to download and install the Lunar Client. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. Just to make it clear, you do need to own Minecraft for this guide to work. But the first thing you need to do is go and open up a web browser. So personally, I use Google Chrome, but you can use any browser you would like. But just before we get any further, I want to give a big shout out to our sponsor, Apex Hosting. They're my favorite Minecraft server hosting provider. They've got so many awesome features like one click install mod packs, 24 seven servers and support. So you can get assistance from experienced server administrators, They've got ultra latency and so many awesome features. If you're interested, I'll put a link down below in the description and the comments, and you can get 25% off your first invoice at the moment, which is awesome. But back to the guide, come to a search engine and you want to go and search for Lunar Client, just like so, and go to the official website, lunarclient.com. Then go to the top right and go and click on download. And now you can go and choose what version you want to download. In this case, I'm using Windows, so I can click on download for Windows just here. And then you'll be taken down here and the download will automatically begin. So then what you can do is go and close out of your browser like this. And you need to go and open up your downloads folder in your file explorer and go and find the installer. Let's go and double click on it like this. You'll go and get the license agreement. I've read through this before and I already agreed to it. And then it's going to go and start doing some downloads. So all you need to do is just wait for it to finish. After it's finished downloading, this will then go and load. And what you can do is come to the bottom right and log in with your Microsoft account or continue as a guest. Personally, I clicked on continue as guest and then I'll click on click to log in in the top right and then I can sign into my Microsoft account. So you can do either way. I've now gone and signed in and as you can see, you can see your account in the top right here. And if you want to go and change accounts, you can just click on this button here. You can see your different accounts here and you can add them as well. Now I want to go and give you a tour of Luna and then we'll go and get into some Minecraft. So let's start over on the left here. So at the top is the home page. You can scroll through here. You can see the news and your friends on the right. Then the next option you've got is the versions. So you've got all these different versions which you can go and play Luna in. So now a lot of people like to use version 1.8.9 and this is because it's really good for PvP. So you can go and check that out there and go and try playing with it and see if you like it. But of course you can go and use these other versions as well. Next you've got the option for servers. So you've got a load of different servers here which you can go and play on. Scroll through here, you can try out the different ones and see what you like. And then next down you've got news and also the store as well. And in the bottom left, you've got your settings. So you can click into here and there's quite a lot to go and choose from, to be honest. Um, at the top, you've got game settings, then general and then notification. And you can also go and enable advanced settings as well. So you can go and choose how much RAM you go and give Minecraft, which is super easy to change and loads more settings as well. And with the advanced, you can also go and see which settings have been added um, because it will say advanced on the left hand side there. And also at the top, you've got some quick options to quickly go and get to places. So let's say I wanted to go and join a server. I could go over to the left and click on servers. Let's say I wanted to play on Hypixel. You can literally just go and click here like so, and it's gonna automatically start joining. As you can see there, it's now launching. And just like that, we're now on Hypixel, which is super awesome. So you can go and quickly join servers just like that. And you can also just go and play in single player as well, if you prefer to do that. One of my favorite Luna features is actually it's got optimization built in and what I've noticed is that my game is even smoother than just if I was running vanilla Minecraft which is super cool and my FPS are higher which of course is better because I can then go and enjoy the game more and of course if you then want to go and switch versions you can go and quit off this and you can go back to the client launcher and you can then choose a different version which you may want to go and play. To go and change the version of Minecraft you're using, all you need to do is just come to the home, then go over to the right and you can click on this little downwards arrow and you can then select from these different versions here. For example, I could click on 1.18 just like that and as you can see it then changes on the right here and I could then go and press on launch game or I could head over to the left and click on servers and then go and choose a server from here. And so that's it. Hopefully we've covered everything. A huge thank you to our sponsor Apex. Once again, if you need a Minecraft server, go and check them out and check out the channel for more useful Minecraft guides. I hope you guys have a very awesome day and hopefully we'll catch you in the next one. Goodbye.